Hello and welcome to another episode of Differential Calculus with Sir R Squared. In this video, we are going to discuss part 2 of trigonometric functions. We are referencing Calculus with Analytic Geometry by Thurman Peterson. Hindi na po natin inilagay dito yung disclaimer at saka yung mga learning objectives sapagkat ito po ay part 2 lamang ng ating uh, video sa trigonometric functions. Dangan lamang po at iniwan ko po ang slide na to upang maging reference po natin kung sakaling uh, kailangan po nating uh, i-review yung uh, formula ng trigonometric functions. Example number 4. Differentiate y is equal to 3 sin x minus 4 cosine x. This is just a case of uh, direct substitution. Uh, hindi na po natin kailangan dito yung ating tinatawag na product rule. Ano? Recta po ito. Sabihin natin na o solution muna. Y prime is equal to 3. The derivative of uh, sine is uh, cosine x. Du dx. So, ang du dx natin ay 1 time is 1 na lang po yan. And then, minus, that will be 4, the derivative of cosine is negative sine x. Then, du dx will be 1. Therefore, y prime is equal to 3 cosine x plus 4 sine x. Ito po yung ating final answer. Example number 5. Differentiate y is equal to x cubed tangent x. So, in this case, we are going to apply the product rule. Ano? Nakalagay na po dito. Apply the product rule. So, ano po yung ating product rule? Inside, derivative of the outside plus outside derivative of the inside. Yun po yung ating product rule. Isulat po natin dito, no? Product rule. That will be inside times the derivative of the outside and then we have plus copy the outside and then multiplied by the derivative of the inside. So, ito po yung ating mga shortcut method na ginagawa para madali nating maintindihan yung derivative. Ipinresent ko po ito sa inyo nung tayo ay uh, nasa introduction to derivative. Yan po ang ating susundan. Uh, kung meron po tayo nito, ito ay inside at ito yung outside. Okay. Yan po ang ating uh, ipapalaw. Ito ay inside at ito yung outside. Alright. We say solution. Ano po yung ating uh, inside? So, inside is x cubed. y prime is equal to x cubed. We just copy the inside. We multiply by that by the derivative of the outside. What is the derivative of tangent x. So, the derivative of tangent uh, x will be second squared x. du dx, itong, itong u, so, ang du dx times 1, no? Alright. Kung naging 2x po yun, eh, di 2 po yung ating du dx. Basta, tandaan ninyo, ito po yung u doon sa du dx. Ngayon, then, tapos na po natin itong first cloud, inside derivative of the outside, plus, sa second cloud, outside, what is outside? Tangent, tangent x, ano? Outside is tangent x, times the derivative of the inside, which is 3x, uh, 3x squared. 
So, yan po yung ating uh, mangyayari sa function. Therefore, we are going to rewrite this. What we will have is like this, ano? Um, y prime is equal to x cubed second squared x plus 3x squared tangent x. Yan. So, kitang-kita natin dyan na meron tayong common factor na x squared. Therefore, y prime is equal to x squared times the quantity x second squared x plus 3 tangent x. Ito po yung ating magiging final answer. Example number 6. Differentiate f of x is equal to cosine x all over 1 plus sine x we say solution, ang gagawin po natin dito ay yung ating uh, tinatawag na quotient rule. Ang quotient rule po natin, kung natatandaan po natin ay sabi natin down times the derivative of up or u prime minus up times the derivative of down or d prime all over down squared. Therefore, para po hindi tayo malito. No? Kung sanay po kayo dun sa regular derivative, uh, eh di pwede rin naman po. Kaya lang ito po yung ating uh, preference po sa pagsosolve. Maaari nyo pong sundin, maaari din naman pong hindi. No? So what is down? F prime of x is equal to down is uh, 1 plus sine x. Yan po yung down natin. Tapos, ano po yung derivative ng up natin? Derivative ng up natin is negative sine x. du dx, e eh, x lang po yan, e eh, times 1 po yun, ano? Minus up, which is cosine of x, times the derivative of uh, 1 plus sine x. 1 is 0, sine x is uh, cosine x times du dx times 1. All over, 1 plus sine x quantity squared. Okay. So, yan po yung ating uh, equation. Therefore, simplify po natin. Ha? F prime of x is equal to mangyayari po dyan ay uh, imumultiply po natin ito. Negative uh, sine x. Ito at saka yun, Negative sine x minus sine squared of x. Tapos ito po, minus cosine squared x all over 1 plus sine of x quantity squared. Ngayon, pwede po nating uh, sabihin na uh, ganito yan. F prime of x is equal to negative sine x. Ito po kasi ay identity itong uh, sine squared x plus cosine squared x. Identity po yan. Meron po akong uh, nakalagay sa module na mga identities. At meron din po tayong review of trigonometry. May mga identity po roon. Kayo na po ang bahalang mag-review. All over 1 plus sine x quantity squared. Okay. Almost uh, direct substitution po lahat. Ano? Therefore, f prime of x is equal to negative sine of x minus uh, 1 over um, 1 plus sine x quantity squared. E di simplify po natin negative of 1 plus sine x over 1 plus sine x x quantity squared is equal to negative 1 over cancel na po ito, no? Tsaka yung square negative 1 over 1 plus sine of x Ito na po yung ating magiging final answer For ease of uploading we have to terminate at this point and be back with another video showing more examples in solving derivatives of trigonometric functions. 
At sa wakas ng lahat ng bagay, tayo po'y magpasalamat sa Panginoon Diyos sa pagbibigay sa atin ng lakas at buhay upang mapag-aralan at matutunan ang mga bagay nito. Ang lahat ng parangal at papuri ay sa iyo, Diyos amang makapangyarihan sa lahat na nagahari noon ngayon at magpakailanman. Magpasawalang hanggan. Amen. To God be the glory.